Hello RC fans and welcome back to the channel and today we will be doing a little bit of reviewing the new products I have in this room and what we will be using throughout this channel and we will also be explaining what we will be doing obviously through the Easter holidays so yeah it is the Easter holidays I have two weeks off we've already been through three days and yeah it's took me some time editing this video obviously so yeah it's going to take me a while but yeah, I'm now here, and we're going to view a few products I've bought, and we may have some more coming, I'm not going to tell you guys, but yeah, we'll have a big um, unboxing review on the new RC, which is slowly coming, Getting sl slowly getting other details on it, I should probably close this curtain a bit, let me have a look guys, quickly. There we are, that pro solves the problem, but yeah, I have got a new RC coming, I bought it, and just waiting for the... For it to be delivered, then yeah, we can do an unboxing review and then we also do a test review. But if the weather is staying up how it is at the moment, we will be bashing around outside. So the first thing I want to explain before we get into all the products here, and you guys understand very well, but yeah, the Mega Beast is out of use at the moment. So if I go down here in my parts bin, the controller. We have the stuck trigger, it's completely stuck, but that's an easy fix, but that doesn't work, and this part, part in there snapped, and then undoing it, all the wires snapped, so we'll have to get a replacement um, controller, but thinking about it, I've done a lot of thinking, except buying a whole new motherboard, so a whole new controller I can buy, and then I would have to buy the connector to connect the controller. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take the motherboard out of this one and just put it into the new controller and that should be able to work the Mega Beast again. And then we'll get more bashing out of that. I ain't going to explain anything about the new one. That's going to be for a completely entire different video. But we still have the Land Rover and we may test that in this video. I don't know. We'll test it around the new room and then see how it performs. But the first product I have, if I unplug it for now. Oh, it's making loads of noise. Let me just turn it off. If it's going to, obviously. Is this camera. So, it's a cheap camera. Didn't spare, I think it's about £40. But I have a nice mic on top. This is what we used last video. We have a wind muffler. And then also we have a screen. Yeah, this thing, I think it had pretty good quality on when, as soon as I put it on the phone to edit it, I haven't put it on computer, I haven't sorted the computer part out of it yet, but as soon as I put it on the phone screen, it looked a lot better than what it did on the camera screen, so, yeah, as soon as I figured out about that, this camera's not too bad, the audio is pretty good, I think I only had it on low, not really high, so, good audio for that, I'm using my phone here, so, it could be better audio, maybe not, so, yeah. We've got that as well, but yeah, that's the first product. The second one I'm going to have to bring you down. We have got an entire new mat. I was saying this about the last video when we done the Mega Beast Grease Up. Uh, we had to put a towel down on here, but yeah, this mat is pretty thick. Let's see if we can get the thickness of it. Yeah, but that's some very thick material. Uh, I think it's crafting mats, so if you guys want to get any, just put some crafting mats. Very good things. We also have the batteries here, which we will be putting in the controller or the receiver for the new truck. I think it takes eight batteries by the sounds of it. So, I don't know, I've read about it, it looks pretty good. But, we're getting at another video. Hopefully it's coming soon, maybe tomorrow, by the hearing of it. But yeah, next thing is this tray here. Magnetic tray. Look at that, perfection. So it just holds screws and stuff so then it wouldn't get cluttered all around the desk and lose any screws. Also has, as I said in the other video, little mat things, so that it shouldn't slide around too much. But yeah, a very useful tool on a desk to stop stuff sliding around. The next one which I bought is this. And you guys should know from the last video I used this a lot. We have a whole entire screw set so we've got two nut ones what I do like nuts I don't think I've got anything what uses them yet but they could be useful on the new truck don't know got one 
um, Phillips or crosshead screwdriver, one flathead screwdriver, and three Allen key screwdrivers because most trucks these days come with Allen key heads. And then we have a pair of side cutters, and then a pair of pin nose pliers. Uh, I don't know what these pliers are, but they're pretty good. So they come in use when you're doing electrical stuff, which I've been playing around with quite a bit lately. And then obviously we got this pot of grease, you guys know, after we greased up the truck. But yeah, that's at the moment near enough what I have. I have a couple of ratchet toolkits. Just I think this was about, like I've seen last video, about 10, 20. This is craft right, so you want to get yourself one. That's what you get in it. But yeah, so that's most of the stuff which will let me lighten up. What will probably be used in the video for now. We're hoping to get some more outside product stuff as the sky is pretty blue at the moment. It's really bright out there because we're filming through the day for once. Normally it's like around night time, so it's more quiet outside because I normally have the window open like I have now. But yeah, that's the products what we have. And obviously if I bring you guys over here, this is, if I move the curtain, the whole desk setup here. So yeah, it's not too bad. We've obviously got the Land Rover battery on charge down here. So yeah, and then obviously everything else, not much. And yeah, you got match up here, just basically the main work and stuff, a couple of phone parts, some video equipment. But yeah, if I guys take you over here guys in my room, down here we have my drawers and this drawer we have all the yeah, all the rubbish equipment. So one was for my phone because my phone cracked and that is broken, so we have the new one here, so this one is the Huawei P Smart 2021. So if I can put my curtain back, that does the job. But yeah, this is uh, the other one. I dropped it from top of the stairs, and it just completely yeah. Now my auntie was repairing it, and yeah, it just she broke the display board, the LED. It just went wrong. But yeah, so got a new one. And this one looks quite good. It's obviously a new version, so it's more different than the older versions. But that's what we've got to put up with now. So, just to clarify everything, if I can bring you guys back a little bit, possibly. I should be able to. My desk is pretty clean for once. Like that. This is the Mega Beast State at the moment. We have her yeah, special tyres down here. I really want to try to get you, it's because this other camera's in the way. Let me put you guys like that. This is the plan. Right, so yeah, we have the old tyres on here. Possibly turn you guys, I know, we're moving a lot back. Yeah, so we've got these normal tyres, rubbishy ones here. They do a better job on what these ones do, because these are like completely out of tread near enough. So we put these ones on the back, if you're watching a couple of videos ago, when we were jumping, she was very right back in the air. The back weight really lifted her, so she jumped like that. And yeah, we had a bit of fun. Obviously, I got a really hot glue. The aerials there just completely destroyed. Also, that night one with the big light on top. We did the video before that. We had lights, the suit, um, hot glue on the bonnet. And yeah, like we done it, I think, about five seconds, and the light flew off, so... We put a bolt through the roof and at the moment that's doing pretty well until we broke the controller. I don't know how it broke. We were doing a grease up video. I was going to, when I said I was going to go through it, we were just going to do it across the room and it wouldn't steer at all. So the controller's completely ruined, but that's the state of the Mega Beast at the moment. And here's our little Defender. So the only thing new to this is that we have... Got a white number plate part where we were putting some numbers, probably RC Prime on there, you know the name of the channel, it's a channel truck. We also have a golden one on the back right here, and we'll also put RC Prime on there. So next video, if when we use this, or if we use it, if we're not reviewing the Mega, uh, no, the new truck, it wouldn't be the Mega Beast, the Mega Beast is out for now. But we will get that back in, don't you guys worry. But this Defender, she's gone through a lot. She is the start and the creation of this channel. That's got, this is the truck what started me. 
and started off the channel so yeah we're gonna make sure this thing will never leave the channel we'll always be upgrading it and yeah I haven't done many upgrades it's just my own cheap personalized upgrades but that's still working but yeah we're charging up the battery at the moment but these are my few products I have got at the moment this camera I think it did qu good quality you guys will have to comment to see the good quality on it I don't know I've only watched the video over about 10 times editing it I don't watch them as soon as they're uploaded they're up there so it looked good quality but to you guys it's a comment from you guys so yeah that's the that's the video here so we may yeah we'll end the video here and yeah I hope you guys like the video uh, yeah leave a thumbs up don't forget to click the notification bell and subscribe please uh, well, let's see if we can reach 12 subscribers possibly and let's see if we can get at least two likes on this video I am sorry that I haven't been posting lately. There's been yeah a lot of hard work locating what things are coming and what to do in the videos, but hopefully the new truck will come soon and we will be able to review and test that around. But yeah, apart from that, see you next time guys, bye.